I've had the chance to talk to Jade Jagger about her new jewellery collection called Never Ending. I asked her about her inspiration, what the design process involves, and where it fits into the life of a modern woman. Jade Jagger has just launched a new collection called Never Ending, and I'm lucky enough to be with Jade, who's going to tell me all about this new collection. It was very exciting to work together with First Dibs to create something that I felt um, was especially for them. This collection was very much about the stones and seeing the stones in their sort of true glory, really large pieces. Um, so here you can see the sapphire and all of the sort of world within it. Well, wow, that's a, an entire That's block an of entire black block of sapphire. Fabulous. So taking away from the sort of usual way that we approach um, stones where we're looking for the eye of the stone, the most clear point, I think for me it was about, you know, just the entirety, the never-ending quality of it and following the shape of the crystalline structure. Um, so that's how I came to this sort of architectural shape that also obviously follows the body and the, the form of your um, fingers. You're saying there was a slightly 70s feel, is that right? I Am do, I, I feel that yeah. there's a sort of throwback to the 70s and quite kind of bold, slightly bohemian feeling at the same time as being quite kind of glamorous. I was always very inspired by my, um, my mother and father, sort of mentors around them in the sort of 70s and early 80s, a Calvin and um, DVF and so Holston. We're talking American as well. We're talking American, yes, because that's where I was sort of brought up. There was a sort of certain simplicity I felt in that kind of time that, you know, also for me in this collection is there whilst it's um, got a lot of boldness with its colour and its form, it's got a lot of simplicity in its, in its dominance of the use of stone and, um, you know, a sort of certain understanding and sympathy with the, the stones that you're using and, and making sure that the right pieces um, that we found in the raw materials were correct for each piece. So, you know, each one is pretty unique. So looking at this collection, Jade, I feel there's a, a naturalness about sort of women being themselves. How does that fit into what you were doing when you were designing these? I think so. I think, um, you know, being true to yourself has always been quite important to me. And I think, you know, the naturalness of the stones and the beauty of those are part of, a, of an essence that I want to inspire women to feel comfortable with um, their true, you know, their true natures. Jewellery definitely has that sort of ultimate embellishment of, um, you know, a woman and, and the human form and I think it plays an enormous role as well as um, beauty but also kind of, you know, as a part of our heritage and our heirlooms and the jewellery that I make I hope kind of perpetuates that and, and brings us back to a little bit more timelessness and away from the sort of flippancy that I feel that exists in fashion these days. To discover the never-ending collection by Jade Jagger as well as her other jewellery, visit firstdibs.com where you can see the full range on display. If you want to know all that's happening in the world of jewellery and watches, visit my website thejewelleryeditor.com.